Now I will talk about the second problem. Uh, the first is WSS process. Um, a stochastic process is called white sense stationary process if if its mean is a constant and the autocorrelation is a function of the this one, the time difference. WSS only uses mean and autocorrelation. Um, in practice, these two are much easier to get than the second order density. Based on the mean and autocorrelation, um, we can do state estimation, parameter estimation, and prediction uh, in the MS sense. In communication application, in most cases, we don't care too much on a specific value of the stochastic process. Uh, rather, we pay our concentration on the power of the signal. The autocorrelation function uh, is the which can represent the average power of the signal at T1. Uh, if we uh, if we let T1 equals to T2, uh, which means R T1 T1, we see that when the input is input is the WSS process, the output of, of a stable linear transform system is also WSS. The second is independent increment process, uh, which means x t1 minus x t2 and x t3 minus x t4, uh, t1 t2 and t3 t4 are on non-overlapping intervals. They are independent. So far, we see that Poisson process, random walk, and Weiner process are independent increment processes. It seems independent increment property is somehow related Markov Markov process. Uh, and the third is Markov process, uh, which which is defined by if the past has no influence on the future when the present when the present is known then a process XT is a Markov process. So far we, we see that Poisson process, Poisson in process, semi-random telegraph, random te telegraph, random walk and vinyl process are all Markov processes. Mm. In a real world, many processes have Markov property. The binary transmission in is a discrete time, discrete state Markov process. Uh, in that case, it is called a Markov chain. The, the other is Gaussian process. Uh, a process xt is said to be normal if the random variables x1, xt1, xt2 to xtn are jointly normal for any n and any t1, t2 to tn. Uh, that is the joint density function is shown as follow, where x is the vector of x1 to xn and big X is the vector of uh, random process xt1 to xtn. The statistics of a Gaussian process is completely determined in terms of its mean and autocorrelation. In general, the mean function is is a function of t. Um, we classify Weiner process as one example of stochastic process, and we classify normal process as a property of stochastic process. That is, we treat Gaussian process as a larger class of stochastic process and treat Weiner process as a specific example. Uh, 
Then, then here is the strict set stationary process, uh, which is defined by if it is when uh, if its statistic is not affected by a shift on the time axis. Um, the we can write down this definition in in the formula. So it requires that the joint density function f x x y x two two x n with parameter t one t two to t n equals to f x x one x two to x n if we have the same uh, time shift on all the t t one plus epsilon t2 plus epsilon to tn plus epsilon the its statistics remains the same uh, and the we think that this condition is very hard to meet then we talk about the white noise for vinyl process wt if we wish to discuss its derivative vt equals to the derivative of wt we will have the expectation of vt equals to zero and co auto correlation function equals to alpha delta function t1 minus t2 But actually, vinyl process WT doesn't have, uh, does have derivative. Uh, so we use VT just as a notation. WT is continuous with probability one. It has differential, DWT. Uh, so VT equals to the der derivative of WT is Gaussian. Gaussian white noise with zero mean and impulse autocorrelation function. So we can see here the the mean of the white noise is zero and autocorrelation function is an impulse function. The next is mean ergodic process. Uh, a stochastic process is said to be mean ergodic if the limit of 1 over 2t integral from minus t to t over xt dt equals to the, the expectation of the process in mean square sense. Uh, this represents one kind of consistency. There are others uh, in probability with probability one and etc. The last one is Martingale, which is defined by if the expectation of xt given by xs equals to small x1 equals to x1, where s is less or equal to t. Um, so, in other words, it shows the conditional mean equals to the condition. Uh, this is true for random walk and vinyl process. Okay, that's all.